Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a short project share of a pocket letter that I made for Kayla Crafts and um, she's having a pocket letter challenge and I've never made a pocket letter before. Figured I'd um, go ahead and um, give it a try. So the pocket letter theme that I went with was with the Dulce collection, which is a Prima collection. And I kind of just went with lots of pinks and golds. Um, so let me just walk you quickly through it. So for, and I apologize for the glare because it's already in this um, pocket letter form, um, which is basically, I think this is, um, this type of um, sheet is for baseball cards. So I think it's a two and a half by three and a half um, per pocket and actually this came together really quickly. I think I finished this um, in two evenings um, but haven't had a chance to film it until right now. So um, starting at the top I did a shaker on this um, upper right um, pocket and I love using the transparent stickers from the sticker books and basically I chose some sequins and bubbles that match um, the stickers here so pinks, blues, and yellows. Uh, next, I have a K for Kayla, and it's this is like a transparent um, letter, um, and I layered that with some flowers, um, a mini gold doily, and one of the ephemera pieces from Dulce. And on the left here, I have just a cut apart from Dulce, backed with um, some gold foiled paper that I had from the Maggie Holmes Carousel collection. And I have like a gold, or sorry, a pink heart cabochon. On the next pocket, I had cut out these um, this paper from Carousel, and it's basically like the scalloped edge, and I thought that it would be perfect um, for this pocket because it was a fairly short piece, and all I did was decorate that with some pink pearls and with this really pretty um, iridescent bow that I got from Soleil, who is Enchanted uh, by Crafts Soleil. Um, next, I just have a very simple cut apart again with some gem stickers and a gold heart sticker here. And it, this is like, this is the cut apart here and I backed it on um, some carousel paper. And the next pocket here, I did a lot of layering. I have a cut apart, or I think I did some fussy cutting of this letter out of the carousel paper pad, layered that on top of a Dulce cut apart and then sewed all that onto another sheet of gold foil with carousel paper, which this one has zebras on it. And I attached a um, pink tool bowl um, at the end of that um, uh, sewn uh, piece there. And this one, again, is a cut apart from Dulce. And actually, this is a very small piece. Um, and I actually then layered it on some white polka dot vellum. And then so I have a sentiment that's a celebrate. I decided to put this little pink um, crepe paper uh, or tissue paper um, embellishment here. And just later another sentiment and some gold stickers at the top of this. And so that this pocket wouldn't be too transparent, I added a cut apart from the Dulce collection um, to back that up. And also so that you could hide what was um, on the other side of this pocket. This next one is, I think, my favorite um, pocket, and basically it's just a rosette um, with a cut apart layered on top, and then I have a wooden piece which I embellished with um, some gems, and these are, you know, just sticky back gems, but then I alternated it and tried to make this wooden teapot look like this teapot here in the cut apart. And then just, there's just some small gold bling here. And the last pocket is um, these macarons, which I um, sewed this cut apart onto, again, a carousel paper and added some um, pink and gold gems. And then I added a little flag embellishment here um, with the word fantastic from, you know, the sticker sheet that I had. And then added a um, pink flower with a pearl center to it. And on the back, I just have a few things um, that I gifted Kayla. Um, I have some tool that has um, dew drops on it, some paper clip um, embellishments that have just some ribbon. So that's a sequin pocket. And then here I made a few layered flowers. Um, my information is here. She did request that as part of the pocket letter challenge. Have some bows there and rosettes and stars and more wooden embellishments. 
And finally, I have this little, it's like a tiny wall hanging. And this was inspired by Nyala, who is Paper Button Loves on Instagram. And she had been making a lot of these yarn embellishments and I figured I'd give it a go and decided that um, this mini embellishment was perfect for this pocket. So just added some puffy stickers, hot glued some gold beads and a gold sequin onto that. And then used um, some gold filler um, that's, you know, for packaging that you can get now at Dollar Tree and Hobby Lobby and glue that to the ends of this lollipop stick. And then lastly, just wanted to show um, this tassel, which I made out of just this fuzzy pink yarn, added a um, puffy sticker to it to kind of hide this, uh, the wrapping and the knotting on, on this tassel. I have um, some wire wrap beads and this very cute gummy bear charm that I bought from Carmen Q Crafts store on um, Instagram. And here you go, that's my pocket letter. Thank you again for watching. Have a great day. Bye.